This weather is downright dangerous. When the temperatures dip below zero, you can get frostbite in under five minutes. So what are people doing to protect themselves from the bitter cold? Lindsay Davis is in one of the coldest spots in the nation once again battling the storm for us. Good morning, Lindsay. You are a trooper. Good morning, Beyond. I was just about to start doing my jump in place to stay warm, Dan. It's just getting dressed in the morning. It's becoming a process. The key, of course, layers and covering the extremities. Even hardy cities like Minneapolis, they're starting to have increased reports of frostbite cases. After all, throughout much of the Midwest and Northeast, temperatures are about 10 to 20 degrees below normal. It is bundle up, cover your ears, see your breath cold. Keep moving. You stop, especially on a day like today, that's it, you're done. The kind of weather where mailmen earn their reputations and meteorologists say, I told you so. It is still pretty cold out here. The Arctic blast grip on much of the Midwest and East Coast is so extreme, this North Carolina beach is covered in snow. And in Boston, the commute to work will require a ski mask. So brutal, it's downright painful. The most pain that I ever had in, in my life. This has been a really bad winter for frostbite. Patients go out, they don't realize that they're getting that cold. So frigid, football fans heading to Chicago and Pittsburgh for today's championship games will need jerseys on top of several layers. The team has warming benches down there that you'll see on both sides of the field. So chilly, this bank in Ohio could only muster up a single digit. But it isn't all bad. At least, not if you always wanted to take a polar plunge. There really is no such thing as it becoming too cold to snow. However, the colder it gets, the harder it is to snow. So the good news is that after tomorrow, we can expect a bit of a warm up. But the bad news is that's going to happen just in time for the potential of another massive snowstorm.